Education news now, and during this uh, pandemic, a lot of schools closed in-person instruction and others decided to stay open. And one of the local schools that uh, has remained open for several months now is Garces Memorial High School. Leaders there tell 17 News they've seen considerable success in keeping COVID-19 at bay. 17's Aton Wallace spoke with the principal at Garces today and joins us now with more. And Jim Garces, principal Micah Peck, says the school has been open for in-person instruction since the end of October. Now, at the time, Kern County was in the red tier, which allowed schools in the Golden Empire to phase in in-person instruction without a waiver. Well, Garces did just that. And a high school of roughly 509 through 12th graders returned to in-person instruction for students and faculty who felt comfortable to return to school. Those who are not comfortable do not have to come for in-person instruction. Peck says it's all part of the school's safe plan to open. I think the main thing is we've had an extensive plan. We've, we clean all the time. We have masks. We take their temperatures between every class period. We disinfect between passing periods. We fog our campus every night. Everything's six feet apart. So we had a very extensive plan to do this as safely as we could. Now, she says there have been some challenges, including six students who came down with the virus, but she pointed out it's believed those cases were contracted off of campus. Several public schools also tried to phase in in-person instruction during the fall, but several of them paused the in-person learning when they experienced spikes in cases that has not occurred at Garces. And meantime, we should tell you this school has seen an increase in enrollment, and Peck tells me since the beginning of the pandemic, Garces has not missed one day of instruction. In studio, Aton Wallace, 17 News. All right.